Well, taking pride at Hope High, a group of students using an after school program to change the look of their Providence school. Five artists creating five impactful murals and they don't have to be Picasso, just themselves. We take you to the east side of Providence in this week's Street Stories. Oh, that's coming out dope. See, that's exactly what we wanted to do. Hope High School students have been wanting to take some pride in the building and fix the building up, so the idea was to make the school look a little more beautiful. It's more than just beautifying their high school. So what are we working on here, Kyla? It's about expressing themselves through art. Just touch up stuff at this point. Their canvas. That looks fine. The hallways of Hope High School in Providence. Our students here have great talent. They have great energy, and I think we start showcasing on these walls. We could take pride in our school building. Johnny Rivera is the community specialist at Hope. That looks great, my guy. Their current after school assignment, a mural project. Break out the spray paint. Teaming five students with five mentors from the community. With these ones, are you gonna go with like a lighter brown like this? Rivera knows the significance of keeping students engaged. I grew up in South Providence, Washington Park. Single mother, my mother always tried to keep me in after school programs, keep me out of trouble. I gravitated towards art. It was my way of expressing myself. The other color matcher. Archie Rhodes is a graffiti writer and artist and is part of the mural mentoring program at Hope. Maybe into the uniforms as well. Giving students guidance, but also allowing them to express themselves. Help guide them and teach some of the knowledge that I've developed over the past 20 plus years and then uh, help them hopefully develop into a professional artist or whatever it is that they want to do with art in their life. Each wall a different image, painted by students from abstract to sports and music. It represents students from this school. Giving them a voice without speaking at all. Music can help somebody through tough times. It's kind of like therapy to other people. Helps mentally, helps physically. It's always been a helpful thing. Music always helps somebody no matter who you are. I'm very proud of all of us and imagine like coming back one day and seeing seeing what you once created when you were so much younger and being able to compare it to what I would be working on in the future. Hoping future generations can appreciate the impact these students will make for years to come. I'm hoping to maybe have a reunion one day to come and look back at some of the art and like where was our minds that time, you know? What were we going through? And that will be a fun reunion. Our teacher, Merrick McMurtry, was also a big part of this project. Johnny Rivera says the murals will add to the history of that school that's 86 years old.